you start it. Mm, this is a game that uh, I played in the Brazil Go tournament. Uh, it is the game at the first day. Uh, the most important game I play with the strongest uh, player. It's called Antonio. It's a French player, five ten, and uh, we played uh, very long, very long time to nearly 8 o'clock mm, in the evening let's see this game uh, because uh, it's, uh, I recorded this uh, I can't record this game well so there are some little uh, mistakes uh, the order may be incorrect sometimes but the main part is Okay, I think. I played white, he played black. Mm. He starts like this, so I think he must uh, have some research, research on the opening. If I just play here, mm, maybe he can get either like this. Uh, or like this, he must uh, um, have advantage. So I choose to play here to destroy his pen. But he played here. I I don't know about this just like after this game. Uh, um. Someone told me maybe I can play like this, but at this game I just jumped. Uh, and uh, this this move is also not very good. I think I should uh, just play here, or I can play here. This uh, move just make him very strong. Also, uh, after I played these moves, uh, this uh, seems too close to this stone. I should have moved at least one line further. So after he played that, I think hmm, if I just defend here, so I use uh, six stones to just get uh, ten points. It's worthless. So I played here, but here actually is also not good because I got nothing with this move. If I really want to play th there, I think uh, this maybe is the <coughs> best place because I can also get the corner. Here I uh, am not afraid he to try to connect because I can cut. Then this wall become useful. But I played here. <coughs> so the jump is a very good move. Then this becomes real realistic. So I played this move. Because if I jump, he can come back. And uh, if I jump down, he can come up. So, seems if I want to uh, cut him, this is the only choice. But it's a really a bad shape. Now he played this, I think uh, it's not so urgent. He can play this move first. But he really like to take territory. This move is actually very big. But uh, mm, then I choose to this uh, to play like this to get a sente and uh, then I can attack this two stones. But after he played this, mm, 
if I uh, want to um, cut him, maybe I should play here. But the thing is, I think uh, maybe I should have played here. But the thing is, uh, I think uh, this is too small. After he captured this, mm, there are no territory here. So I choose to play like this to sacrifice these two stones. But uh, he played uh, very uh, aggressive. I thought he maybe will play like this, and uh, then I can play this, or I can play this. But uh, he didn't uh, play like what I thought, so I have to play here. Now the 27 is a very good move, because now if I want to play here to connect, he can come out and uh, maybe I lost this game. So I have to play here. And these two stones are dead. And this move is necessary. Because if I play somewhere else, he can take this uh, sentry for free. So I have to play this. Then I lost uh, a group and uh, lost uh, a corner and uh, lost uh, some territory on the side and uh, got nothing. Maybe just uh, a little bit uh, strength outside. So I try to play this to try to get some influence in the middle. But uh, then he come in. Uh, this move, uh, I think uh, he was uh, thinking he was in advantage, so he played very calmly. Actually, I think uh, he can play like this is also very good. But uh, this is not bad. It's very simple. He can go both way. Now, this move means that if we play this, I can take the corner mm, when I'm attacking this group. But uh, if I play this side, after he play this, he can take the corner. So I play this side. But uh, he know uh, my strategy, so he destroyed my corner. I have to cut, cut him. But here, uh, I'm very dangerous because uh, actually I can play here. Maybe this is a choice. Uh, this is the easiest way you can see. Mm. Yeah, maybe I need a move here. Then, or I can play here. Then I got, got this. Um, but uh, this corner is uh, also very big. He already got lots of territory. Then, uh, suppose he just uh, take this corner. Let's see. Uh, how much points we get? He got uh, thirty. This is uh, ten. So I always count like this. This is about thirty, and uh, this shape is nine plus one is ten. So I always count this shape as ten. So it's forty, and uh, this shape five. With uh, with two is ten, so it's about uh, ten, twenty, and uh, fifty, fifty-six, and uh, 
But uh, how many do I have? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. So it's about 56. And 66. 76. So it seems um, not enough. Because usually uh, the, the one who got one territory is um, very hard to play. If he feel uh, not enough now, he can just play like this. I'm very hard to get him. So at this time, I was uh, far behind. I mean the territory. So I have to think of some new things to try to connect this. And if I can connect this and get this territory, uh, then it will be very big. I think uh, uh, I still have chance. So I played this move first. And uh, he played that. But uh, in fact, uh, he can play this, I think. This is not that important compared to this card. So. When I played here, uh, I have a thought that uh, because he played like this, he must think he's seeing advantage. So he can't take risk to play like this. He must uh, uh, want to save his uh, advantage. So he played like this. And then I try to connect. He can mod. Actually, uh, this move I think he should play here. Like the same shape here is very good. If I play here, he play here. Then he got uh, lots of territory. So I have to play here. Then he can come out easily. This is the simplest way for him to win. Mm. So it means I, I can't play here. I should have just cut and see what happened. But I played here, he played here. Then I realized that uh, if I cut here, uh, he can kill these two stones and then it becomes very hard for me. Mm, so I have to cut here. To uh, make his group also dangerous then maybe I can find some chance to uh, win back this game. This move is necessary and uh, so make make me these four stones uh, very dangerous. So I have to leave this uh, four stones first. Uh, actually, there is one thing at this side be because. This, in this shape, he can't uh, cut my four stones uh, because this move is like a sentry to the corner and uh, then I can play like this mm, I can Atari this first and uh, also if he want to come out to kill these three stones I'm very happy because these three stones is uh, very very small compared to this. Then if play like this, I can win. Uh, so he can't cut here. He played here, but uh, huh? but this move is not a good move. Mm. Definitely, he should play here. And uh, play here. It's very hard for me to um, to live. If I play here, it's that. 
even if it's it is alive. After this move, he can cut. He can cut me. Then I can't do like this. Or, or he, or to be safe, he can maybe cut like this. Yeah, this is simple. So he missed this chance because. Uh, because this after this move, I make this group alive with the sente and this, with this shape, he still can't cut here. So I got a sente and uh, I uh, I can play first at this side. Ah, uh, here actually, uh, this game is uh, one hour per person. Hmm. And uh, and after one hour, we have uh, about twenty minutes, uh, twenty second per move. It's uh, actually it's fifteen stones within five minutes. So at this time, uh, I have only five minutes left in the one hour. Um, but he he has lots of time. Uh, but after this move, I just uh, uh, go around to see other games. Uh, actually, I didn't calculate this because I also uh, because I thought he was in advantage. He must uh, uh, mm, think he can win this game, and uh, he don't want to take any risk. But uh, I don't mind to take some risk. And uh, he thought uh, I was uh, already calculating well with this part. So he answered me and used uh, 10 minutes. Also I played this. Actually this is uh, a good move to save that. But I think uh, he needn't to worry about this, and he should play like that. After these moves, uh, I'm trying to attack this uh, corner, but uh, he has some something here. Uh, why this is a good move? Because if he answered uh, at this side, then this becomes a sente. After this becomes a sente, he cannot get this push, as you can see later. But this is good. So now, after I play here, he got this push. Actually, now I should have just uh, come back and let him to uh, to live, or even before. If I let him live, he has six points. But I played here, and uh, um, it seems a call, but actually it is uh. Uh, it seems he's dead, but actually uh, he's not dead. If I played here, he can play this and uh, play this. Then I can't play that. I have to play this because with this shape, he has eight liberties, and I only have five, so I lost the fight. Uh, that's why I can't play there. I have to come back now. Then he took this to live. But with this shape, he got uh, eight eight points, better than six, but uh, six. But uh, I also got some uh, benefit because later this some of this may become sente. So I connect here. Now, um, 
now uh, we can see uh, we got lots of points here and lots of points here and eight points here and a corner here but uh, I got nothing only two points here in the whole board I only got two points so now I, it is the best chance for him to win the best move I think for him is to play here then he win the game he needn't to worry about this cut this cut is very small he can continue to play I can at most got 20 points here but he got 25 35 about 40 about 60 uh, I only got 25 I must lose this game so this is the uh, um, best chance for him to win but he played here that is also but I have no other choice I have to connect this if I play like this after he captured this his group is alive and then uh, this is very loose I can't mean make any points also there is a cut here uh, so I have to connect try to make some uh, uh, to threaten to his group but uh, maybe uh, it was in that situation he uh, can't see the whole board he just play like this I, I'm very happy when he played this this is the biggest mistake of him in the game uh, before he he played very good and I have no chance but uh, with these two moves, I think uh, uh, my chance is coming. These two moves actually got no points, no eyes, and just make his group happy. Now I play this very good move. Now it's very hard for him to turn back because this five stones is uh, already very heavy, so he connect and I play this. You see this this group now is uh, very dangerous. I, I can attack this group to make some uh, benefits. Uh, I play like this because like this just make him a good high shape. So I play like this. He just uh, escape. And uh, I play this because there is a cut here. Uh, this move is to make uh, myself uh, safe first and uh, aim for this cut. So he has to save this cut. And then I can attack. Do not let him to go through easily. Then he has to try something to make an eye. And uh, after these moves, I took this. This is very big. Because uh, if I really want to kill him, uh, maybe uh, I should play here. Then the thing is, uh, if I can't kill him, definitely he can get uh, lots of advantage here. and no eye but if we can live here like this I calculate this a little bit um, he can cut here and I can't uh, live maybe the best way for me uh, to try to live is to play here but But I can't live. Yeah, I can't live. It's the same. So 
This stone cannot come out then he's live. So uh he's alive. So I can't play that to take risk. I should uh, just uh, keep the territory first. You see, after he played these two moves, I made such a big territory. Before, yeah, before if he he played like that, I got no territory, and these two stones are very weak. I just got three stones here, and he also can get some advantage benefits here. So after this, he realized that uh, I got lots of territory. He has to uh, come inside. Uh, this is uh, very compli uh, complicated, and I have no time at that uh, at that time. Mm, I have to play uh, in twenty minutes, uh, twenty second per move. So if I really want to kill him, maybe uh, let me think. Maybe I have to play this. But uh, if I can't kill him, uh, if he can live, then I'm, I must lose this game. So I just play a simple move to play a call. But he also have a chance to connect. Just connect, and it's also very complex. But uh, actually, at that time, I think he has a similar uh, thinking as me. He may think if he connect, and he was killed, then he lost. So uh, most of us agree to take a call because the call is very easy to see, and. Uh, and this move is uh, a very bad move for him because uh, if he want to uh, find coast right here mm. he can just play like this and uh, <coughs> then he can get uh, another coast right and I got only two points but uh, after he play this I play this I got one two three four and uh, four, four points. So I got uh, two more points, and also this uh, stone is uh, in my mouth. So I have one, two, three, four, five. Five plus uh, five. But uh, since we didn't, I didn't capture it. So I got about three. Three plus two is five. I got five points more with this exchange and uh, then um, the an another thing is he got no coast rat here he lost one coast rat and uh, five points with this move oh uh, this actually is an exchange before I did uh, because I was running out of time I just uh, play some moves to save time so now I played here. Also, this move, um, oh, this move is okay. And uh, then he used this as a uh, uh, coast rat because um, the thing is he can't uh, use uh, these things as coast rat because after this, this group has no eye. So here he only got one coast rat. Is this? And uh, then I play this uh, as a coast rat. And he played this. I think this move he, he lost some points also. He can play like this. Because later you can see I can easily kill this stone. I get two points and one here, three points. And uh, if we connect here, I got no points. Also, 
after kill this stone, I have an eye. He can, he, he, uh, it's meaningless to cut here. Now, if we connect here, there is still some sentry. So it's also worth about five points. So with this call and these two call threats, he lost about ten points. So it it means the small things are use are very important for the uh, for the game. Sometimes we can't see the difference, but uh, this is very big. So now he has no cold threats because they played some uh, uh, wrong moves here. Then he have to take the big moves, but I don't think he's enough. So if he really want to take big moves, hmm, let me think. Yeah, maybe this. He can play more aggressively, but it seems like this maybe is better. But if if this doesn't work, maybe he will lose small points. So here is uh, reasonable. Uh, now I can't answer. If I answer, he can have a lot of more cost threat. So I take the call. Then he got another big move. Um, you see, after I uh, attack this group, I got uh, such a huge territory. It is uh, the only territory I got in this board. Before, if he play like this, I got uh, nearly no territory. But now, this territory is enough for me to win. I took this because this move has one, two, three, uh, one, two, three, four, five, five point, uh, more than five points, about six point, six to seven points, and also I kill his eye. So if I play this, he can live easily, and uh, this move I can't see the points. So I play this, take seven points, and uh, he has to jump out. So now, after I I win this call, I I'm still attacking this group. The battle still not finished, so I can get this move and uh, attack him. Now I also got some advantage here by attacking this group. So this is the worst decision he made in this game. Just because these two moves I made I turned the disadvantage mm, to advantage for me. Now now I, I can play like this, but uh, now I am in advantage, so I just play safe to take this very big move. I let him connect. If I am still not enough, definitely I will come down here. So after this, uh, there is not much territory. N uh, not not much uh, big moves left. Just uh, small things. Uh, the order maybe is not correct, but uh, I remember the shape is almost like that. No. Oh. Uh, later he tries to uh, fight this call, but I win this call, so it's almost like this. Yeah, it's almost like this, and uh, you s later 
he he need to fill these two stones. Also, he only got uh, eight points here. And uh, this place, uh, oh, later he also made some mistakes. He played something here first, and then um, made hi make his lip twist very tight. So I got this move and this move. Yeah. Also, I got this connected. So let's come to the points. Here, uh, it is captured. So one, two, three, four. It's eight. Uh, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. This shape is ten. Fourteen. This shape is ten. Fifteen. Ah, uh, four, four. Huh? Uh, this is 8, 9, 10, 11, 13, uh, 13, 23rd, this is uh, 33rd, 33, 33, 34, 34, and uh, this is 54, 55, 56, 66, 7, 8, Nine, ten, uh, six, so eighty. Ah, uh, sixty-six is seventy, seventy-eight. So I have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Ah, uh, thirteen, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, twenty-four. Twenty-five, and uh, this is ten. Twenty-five plus ten is uh, thirty-five. Uh, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Uh, fifty-one, fifty-two, fifty-three. Six three, mm, four, five, six, eight, nine, ten, seventy. So I got seventy eight. He got seventy eight. But uh, actually, after uh, um, you see, if it's like this, I got seventy eight. He got seventy eight. Then I must win this game because I has uh sixty six point five call me, but. Uh, the mm, the result of the game is uh, I win even more. I win about uh, um, three points more. So mm, this game, mm, what this game told us is uh, we always need to see the whole board. Sometimes, just uh, two moves, just one move. Yeah, just one mistake will make you lose this game. This is a uh, mistake, the biggest mistake for him. I have lots of mistakes through this game. Uh, from the beginning, at this Josuke, I shouldn't extend too much, and also I played some wrong moves here and uh, also some wrong moves here uh, but uh, with one uh, big mistake he gave, gave this uh, game back to me hmm. yeah so that is the end of this game thank you for watching